Hey there friends, welcome to episode 46 of my RimWorld Swamp Viking playthrough. I'm Icon and it's been a pretty uh, rough episode. Um, little got gunned down by uh, the Grey Goblin Raiders, we lost a donkey and uh, Ironhead is now a um, little bit uh, unhappy. He's most of the time unhappy because he just wants to be drunk or uh, whatever because that's just his thing. Um, but uh, now his uh, his bonded uh, donkey Keiko died and um, I'm afraid for our prison uh, about the well-being of our prisoners. So um, the Silent Neuroformer, I'm gonna reserve that for uh, um, for Lozano when he's uh, back and uh, poison synthesis um, do I have scientists uh, present yes so I just want to uh, clean out this uh, room a little bit because I feel like uh, we we do have a lot of problems uh, filling up um, or emptying out this area here so I figured maybe we want to have uh, a a storage for um, for guns or something like that. I feel like there's a uh, strong necessity of uh, of doing th something here. So um, let's see. Are there any uh, less impactful drugs we could uh, we could gift to Ironhead? Oh, Luzano is. Uh, meeting another caravan but uh well they got cleaner base stations well but apart from that digestible resurrector nanites my god ah <sighs> well well a persona core what, what was this what is this uh caravan like uh, crazy guys so we should have ambushed them and taken their treasures but uh, not as three people. <laughs> I think that won't be uh, going well. All right. Very happy that none of my uh, colonists had to die in that uh, combat. Really, really good. Why is there an Arctic lion that's uh, dead and not uh, hauled in? Things I'd like to know. Okay. So today Lozano and the others will uh, come back home. So finally I'll be able to create my big bad meditation throne. So the real sad news is I don't seem to have enough uh, very very precious materials I'd say. Or, let's see, a jade throne would need 300 jade. So I don't have uh, such large amounts of uh, gemstones available unless I mine out all that quartz. That could work, honestly. Let's do this. I always feel like uh, a, a throne of this magnitude should be uh, to some degree impressive, if you get my idea. Okay, so apart from all these other things, my power supply is now secured and uh, we're gonna um, turn the old wood generators off. I'm even uh, considering uh, dismantling them, but I, um, I haven't made up my mind fully around that topic yet. So what's that? Yet another cougar. So. Let's take care of that problem. Lozano's Baron Ceremony. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. So today it seems like I'm gonna be uh, mining out all the uh, necessary um, quartz for that endeavor. Pretty sure I will do that uh, manually. So where does the Cougar go? Um, I want to research the multi-analyzer tech with my tech prof, uh, oh, well, whatever. So, Iron Head can just, uh, use the tech prof persona core. Um, I had one, and, uh, skipping the research time of the multi-analyzer is a really, really beneficial thing. So I decided we'd like to have that. 
and I'll drop down the uh, multi-analyzer here. Luckily, I got all the necessary materials to construct one. It's not always that easy. But, well, I guess that's one of the biggest, uh, of one of the major um, advantages of starting tribal lies in the fact that you accumulate so many materials like plus steel and components along the way that once you hit the industrial age, you will uh, have quite a lot of items available. At least that's uh, true during my roleplay runs. So here, um, I want to select all the ship chunks on the map and deconstruct them all because uh, reasons. So um, I just noticed that uh, there's a massive abundance of wealth accumulated there. So I'll turn um, Ragnolf away from the construction work here for a moment. At least I'm gonna let her uh, build that royal bed. I I think that's a good thing, but uh, my uh, junior constructor can do the rest. First, uh, no, no, Ragnolf, no, no, you finish that. Especially those uh, royal furniture jobs. I don't want to have a, uh, a beginner um, on it. This furniture bears an image of an empty belt. Killer raider. So it either um, shows the leftovers of a raider or it is uh, a, uh, a direct uh, insult to the um, person's weight which is sleeping in that bed. I really like that. All right. So jokes aside, we're now gonna dig out a lot of uh, new machinery here. People are picking out on food. Can we afford that? Oh yeah, no problem at all. So uh, assigning Ragnalf back to uh, main duty mining is uh, pretty good for the income of our colony. Oh, I need a research project, of course. I uh, just finished the multi-analyzer tech. Um, differently. So precision rifling will need gas operation, so let's research that. I really want to have um, that attack available and uh, also I need to uh, get rid of items. I do already uh, have um, the assignments down to uh, smelter away things, but it's obviously not enough. So. I'm gonna designate this room as a storage. That's a nice idea. This room is not used at all. And as far as I see things, those uh, weapons are um, the biggest uh, problem there. And I'll just uh, haul away all the melee weapons out of this room and let's see what'll happen there. I assume that this alone should be uh, possibly um, eliminating a lot of the prob a lot of the uh, storage problems there. So uh, let's upgrade the Silink. Yeah. Did I learn something? Far skip. So uh, skip the caster along with anyone standing near him to an ally at a distant location. Oh yeah. This can send people far across the planet, but only works if there's a willing ally on the other side to use as a navigation beacon. Oh yeah, that's uh, that's the big stuff. Wow. So uh, Lozano is now able to teleport people, um, or teleport himself and a few people to, uh, to somewhere. So basically uh, Lozano is now the perfect guy to be sent on caravans, because uh, if there's uh, any problem he'll just uh, teleport back home and uh, even teleport uh, other people with him, so I like the idea. So meanwhile, Strick and Dawson, let's check them out. Um, Strick Guerra, mercenary gunner, high shooting skill, high animal skill, high medical skill. Um, hi, I want to recruit you. So um, Dawson, how about you? Hates dumb labor. Yeah, you're, you're gonna um, end up in the uh, um, with the uh, Imperial traders. Okay, so now, oh wow, there's even more gemstone. 
What's Ragnolf doing? Ah, yeah, she's uh, heading over there to look at the quartz side. Good. So let's see. 300 um, pieces are necessary. I received 35 out of one. So that's 70, 105, 140, um, 140, 175, 210, 245. No problem. No problem at all. Resocialization offer. <laughs> no, 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 Dawson. You're the person we're selling off. Nice try, though. I respect that. So, oh yeah, there's uh, one thing though. I Ragnalf needs to build those uh, things that are too complicated for other people there. Oh, she failed while uh, while building that. Shame on her. Wasting materials on a multi-analyzer is really, really unfortunate. But it's, uh, at the same time, not really that much of an issue, honestly. Alright, there we go. Now that this has been dealt with... Um, I just hope that this Ice Age will subside one day, soon. This warps my uh, area, this warps my um, gameplay here a lot. Ooh, those elves have a uh, herd revenge chance, I don't dare to. Oh yeah, those deers are harmless though, alright. Meanwhile, uh, at the wild tailor shop, we're uh, quite busy here. And Tiberius, sad wandering because of s chemical starvation. So once that ice age is over, I promise you guys we're gonna plant down huge psychoid leaf fields and uh, and uh, what are they called again? Wait a sec, I can't replace because not in home area. Interesting, interesting sentiment. Um, we're gonna um, bring up some some new joy and comfort as soon as the ice age is over. Smoke leaf, psychoid leaves, you name it. All right. So, isn't there any other uh, person passionate about mining here? No. Seriously, only Ragnolf caring the least little bit about mining. So, uh, yeah, Dor Dawson, if you would have been uh, passionate about mining, I would have reconsidered my uh, decisions there, but not like this. Alrighty, so uh, enough of that. I have to uh, mine out some quartz to uh, make that Baron promotion happen. So no, you're not digging at the top. You're digging up the quartz. The important things first. The uh, colonists almost never automatically prioritize the things that uh, are roughly important to you, so... Uh, well. New lovers. Dawson and uh, Strick. So, uh, Dawson is really, really, um, quite a charmer. So, Strick charmed Dawson by saying good things about her honesty. I see. So, fell in love with a prisoner. Great. Geothermal uh, generator is down. That was not what I was thinking about. I wanted a, uh, I wanted a biofuel refinery. That's what I wanted. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna deconstruct those generators and uh, set up the refinery in there. Because I do need um, some steady resupply of chem fuel there, or we won't be able to do anything. And to store the chem fuel, I need a little chamber here. So let's see, how much quartz 
175. All right, Rocknolf, you're not done yet. We need the full package. I want that meditation throne. Ambrosia binge on Schultz. Due to jealousy. Alrighty. That should be, uh... The last of them. Alright, that's enough. So, we're gonna reinstall this, uh, other, uh, meditation throne in the guest chamber. It's kind of like a, uh, or, wait a sec, no. No, 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 no. I need to build that new throne first, and then we're able to move the other one. Just realized that this would be, uh, quite foolish, because, uh, People like our boss go crazy if there's uh, no more throne for them. Wow, that's a big thing. Okay, so um, let's build that uh, throne here behind that drape. It's gonna be the surprise. Okay, so Ragnalf will be uh, now on the construction duty for that uh, throne mostly I hope my resources will be enough 3,000 work units though wow that's a lot but uh, then again I'm very very curious about uh, its stats I never built a uh, grand uh, throne ever before because I never went down with the nobility gameplay this far ever so I'm really uh, Really curious about how this will play out. Okay, gas operation. So, double auto cannon. Hmm, that sounds effective. But no. What I'm gonna start out with is uh, the um, precision rifling tech, because uh, this way I can finally create assault rifles and sniper rifles, and these are. Uh, by far two of the most important weapons in game. Sniper rifles are awesome against centipedes and ev basically every mechanoid trying to ruin your day with this heavy neutron blaster is uh, your preferred target for um, your um, sniper rifles. Alright. Oh, awesome. So Rocknalf is uh, working on that right away. Um, gonna put up a uh, stone door here, usually I don't uh, like to use stone doors, Psychic Addiction. Um, hi on Yayo, good job. Well, it's gonna be an issue later. I got social skill trainers and plant skill trainers, I should use those. All right, Lozano will receive the social one. No, use, not uh, pick up. Oh, another smoke launcher, thanks. These things come in handy. I prefer smoke grenades, but uh, you never know when you need tw uh, two of them. And uh, plants. So let's see, level 14, level 10, well, Let's give that one to Lumpy. I mean, it's not really uh, that um, important for Lumpy, but uh, it's not useless either, you know. So, um, Ragnolf is relaxing socially. So, I definitely want to administer the... Uh, production process of the or, or monitor the production process of this one uh, manually so I need to relocate the braziers too because uh, the throne is bigger than that All right. but the uh, really important uh, moment is when the uh, throne is being finished it doesn't matter that uh, frog um, works down all these work units with his uh, or her lower um, skill value, it's a him. Um, what's 
What's gonna matter is who's finishing that building, so I don't mind at all. Yeah, so uh, the Ice Age is soon hitting its first year. Meanwhile, Ragnolf is finally getting these uh, jobs done that I uh, assigned. I don't know how much time ago. It's, feels like it's been forever. So, oh, there's uh, some old floor panels also left. Gotta remove those too. So yeah, here that's uh, that's the junk side. I'll uh, still drop down an orbital trade beacon just to make sure that if there's ever going to be a stellar trader willing to buy that junk I'm going to be able to just uh, leave it with them and be like take it I don't need it anymore also uh, shields have been researched and uh, ooh, there's a pack of blizzarisks here so Okay. Let's send Griff um, to rescue the uh, the rat, if that's even possible. No. Well. Okay. It's uh. Looks like it's more of a revenge thing. But I mean, it's not like rats are uh, too useful. But uh, we have to uh, put this uh, fox down. Nobody touches the rats of the rat clan except for the rat clan. Simple as that. Combat suppliers. Hmm, neat. So I really gotta take care of those uh, blizzarisks, but um. Well, I'd say we're, we're gonna do that after a little chit-chat with those uh, combat suppliers. I mean, the blizzards are not really um, an imminent danger right now. Minus 37 degree. Ah, uh, yeah, so uh, that's... They're leaving the map because of the dangerous temperature? You guys, you... You lazy... No! Okay, never mind. Okay, I didn't expect that. One, one might expect that people uh, going on a caravan during these cold temperatures would know what they're up to, but uh, they don't. Okay, so uh, with this amount of uh, temperature plunge, I think it's very, very important to hunt down everything on the map. Because um, very soon there's... Uh, going to be nothing left uh, to be uh, hunted here during for the rest of the winter. I already know how these things go down. When the temperatures plummet like this, um, it doesn't take long and then there's uh, nothing left which you or you, which uh, will migrate back onto the map and then it's gonna be a really really hard winter. But uh, luckily we have a lot of uh, money so if anything too crazy should be happening I'll just uh, I'll just buy some food, but still we need to take care of that. So uh, Addison and Little are allowed to go home. I know it's, uh, it's a little bit mean of me, huh? To uh, send them in here and then send them away again. So Tiberius is uh, never um, equipped with anything by default. Or, well, no frog will uh, will stick to the, uh, to the chain shotgun. I really think that's uh, something something we I'd like to uh, keep here so I'm starting out with the with the mega sloth here but let's uh, head over to the blizzard risks and uh, they went into pack revenge so uh, I'm sending my uh, doggos uh, as a uh, precautionary measure because uh, I respect those buggers. They are really, really fierce enemies. 
And it's way easier to patch up one of my uh, doggos than uh, risking an infection of an, on one of my uh, colonists there. Just my sentiment here. And uh, that Thermodon too. Oh, look at that. They're, uh, Thermodons are living uh, incendiary launchers. I never attacked one, but I uh, felt like today is the day. Okay, so uh, that's that. A few burns, but apart from that, everything went fine. So, uh, wildlife-wise, that's it. Okay. At least the lab is now finished. Oh, there's uh, a few more things we need to do. Um, there's going to be a heater inside here, at least one. And uh, we might be not needing it now, but uh, one day this place will also need a cooler. There we go. One day this place will need a cooler. So... Do I really want to store my chem fuel here? I don't think so. Doesn't sound like a smart idea to me. But then again, uh, if I, there's always going to be some uh, hassle. Either I'm transporting the wood um, a long distance, or I'm transporting the chem fuel a long distance. So, ah, uh, whatever. Don't uh, don't want to be uh, don't want to be like that. Oh no, heavy uh, terrain affordance, okay. Luckily I have uh, what it takes. Okay, got the precision, precision rifling. Okay, so it turns out that only these two tiles are the issue. So, precision rifling has been researched. Um, what's next? Um, let's see, artillery, well no, sentry guns, I want to have uh, something that's, uh, I want these in good, because <laughs> these aren't really, uh, aren't really good at all, honestly, I didn't like them. But that's just fine. So it turns out I won't be finishing the throne uh, during today's episode because, uh, well, obvious reasons. So, um, well, or am I? Don't know. Possibly. So, uh, yeah, now it's not even uh, fully winter yet, and uh, we already have not enough food for the full time of winter. So that's already an issue there, so... I don't really want to slaughter any of my animals here, because they are just that... Uh, that good companions here. But, uh, let's see. I'm pretty sure there's going to be some wild animals, but, uh... Iron Hat is uh, on the tobacco binge. Soon he's not going to be uh, only Iron Hat, he's also going to be Iron Voice. Or something like that. Alright, so... I really want uh, to finish that uh, throne during this episode, so... Uh, Let's annoy Rocknulf and uh, send her on a night shift or an early uh, an early beginning shift because I'm absolutely sure that Rocknulf is able to uh, whittle down this throne in the last minute this uh, episode has to offer. So the bloody Radyax, twenty-two manhunting Radyax. I would re I would receive a uh, Persona Zeus hammer in return. I gotta say, if it would have been an Odin hammer, maybe, but a Zeus hammer is just the wrong uh, culture here, friends. I'll uh, take that decision into next episode, luckily. I mean, uh, 22 Radiax, I don't think that should be too much of an issue here. But, um, well, little do I know. I mean, Radiax um, certainly could be quite dangerous. 
All right, so let's see. Will it be a good quality? A good quality, literally. Okay, so uh, hmm, looking neat. Let's check out the stats. Uh, Beauty 50. Well, I expected more from that. Anyways, friends, thanks so much for watching. We did it almost. Next episode, uh, we're going to make Lozano a Baron. And apart from that, drop me comments down below. I'd be, I'd be very, very happy to hear from you. As usual, leave a like, leave a subscribe. This series can use all the support you have to offer. And until then, have a great time. And hopefully you come back for more. See you then. Bye-bye.